In some questions, we know the volume of a solid and are asked to find one of the dimensions. For example, a radius or a height. To do so, we use a letter to stand for the unknown dimension. For example, R for radius or H for height. Then we form an equation by putting our expression for the volume equal to the given volume. So basically we let the formula equal the volume and we fill in the pieces of information that we do know. So solving the equation gives the required dimension. A sphere has a volume of 1 litre i.e. 1000 centimetres cubed. Taking pi to be 3.14, find the length of the radius of the sphere correct to one decimal place. So we're trying to find the radius. So we know that the volume is equal to 1000. So we're going to get the formula for a sphere, which is 4 over 3 pi r cubed, and let that equal to 1000. And then we just solve for r. So we're specifically told to let pi be 3.14. So we have 4 over 3, then we swap pi for 3.14, brackets around it. The or stays as it is, we have cubed and equal to 1000. Then 4 over 3 multiplied by 3.14 is 4.18667 or cubed, so that's equal to 1000. So then to get the or cubed on its own, we're going to have to divide across by 4.18667. So 1000 divided by 4.18667. It's going to be 238.8533. And then to get the or on its own, the cubed comes over and becomes cubed root. So you get the cubed root of 238.8533. And that gives us 6.2 and it's centimetres. Because we had our volume as centimetres cubed. So the radius of a sphere with a volume of 1000 centimetres cubed is going to be 6.2 centimetres. So the radius is 6.2.